Hi, welcome to this video today, which is all about how to achieve Forex trading success. I'm going to be going through some public misconceptions on Forex trading and also um, quoting some, you know, quoting from some of the great traders of all time on how to make money. I'm going to come to the first public misconception, which causes no end of traders to lose. And the misconception is that the way to make money is with algorithmic trading systems. And the people who make the most money with these algorithmic trading systems are hedge funds and big banks. You read it all over the net, you know, all these um, big banks and hedge funds making huge profits for clients. Now, I was reading a book at the weekend, um, it was a fantastic book actually, it's by Steve Lacker, it's called The Hedge Fund Mirage. And he actually puts this all in perspective. And he was actually doing an analysis of all the hedge funds uh, as a composite. And he compared the track record with T-bills. And between 1998 and 2010, if you'd have invested in T-bills, you'd have made twice as much money as in a hedge fund. So really, what, what that's telling you is these hedge funds with all their algorithmic trading systems basically are doing low single digit gains as an average, which is a very poor performance. Now, you might be thinking, well, how come they can't make more money? They've got all the resources, they've got you know, huge amounts of technology. The answer is, of course, technology doesn't beat the market. Also, these funds have a focus on short term trading. You read about, you read it all over the net about day traders and scalpers making money. They don't make money, they lose money. Now, a hedge fund or a bank is always going to be day trading, but that's to make fees for themselves. It's not going to be to make client profits. What you'll also see online is brokers, they'll say things like, all day traders and scalpers are welcome. Well, of course they are, because they're going to lose money. Um, brokers perpetuate the myth as well, because they want to make money. You know, they're telling you that day trading and scalping makes money, because they make money. You're not going to make any. So you've got the basic problem is the public believes that the way to make money is short term trading with algorithmic systems or, or any type of computer trading. And the faster it is, the better and all this sort of stuff. But it's total nonsense. Obviously, you get all the robot signal services telling you that you're going to make money with them. Um, but they're just really basically not telling the truth because none of those systems or none of the ones that come in my inbox have got any chance of making money. So how do you really make money? Well, what I'll do is I'll just give you a story which will just show you how to make money. And I'm going to go back to the most famous uh, trading experiment of all time, turtle experiment. Richard Dennis was a very famous trader, decided to show anyone could learn to trade. So what he did was he taught a group of people, no trading experience in 14 days, a long-term trend following system to lock into and hold long-term trends. And when he taught them the system after 14 days, he let them trade. They made 200 million in four years. Many of them are still trading today, some of the most successful and well-known traders in the world. So the way to really make money in trading is to trade long-term. The odds are better and you'll make more money. And of course, you're gonna spend less time on your trading. Now, the other thing that Forex traders have got to get used to, or if you're serious about making money, is the accuracy of your trades. How many winners to losers are you on average going to have? Now, again, you'll see robot sellers and all the rest of them telling you 90%, 78.8% I saw one today. These figures are ludicrously high. I mean, you're probably going to make 30 to 50% of your trades profitable. That's it. And I was reading an interview with um, Bill Lippershutz. He's one of the most famous traders of all time. And he said, you've got to get used to making money on 35% of your trades. Now, that doesn't matter that you only have 35% of your trades that win or 50 or 30. It's the difference between profits and losses per trade. If you're a long-term trend follower, it doesn't matter if you have small losses because you can cover them because you're running trades for weeks on end. Now, the turtle traders, um, the ones in the Dennis experiment I mentioned earlier made 200 million. I think they lost 70% of their trades. 
Um, and you'd think that's terrible, but look at the money they made. It's massive. Now, if you want to make money, <clears throat> you need a long-term trend following system and you need to have the discipline and confidence to hold it. Now, my own view is you're never really in Forex trading to be able to follow signal services, even if the guy is successful, because unless you understand how and why the system will eventually win, you'll never ride out losing periods without wanting to override the system. So my own view is you need to get an education. Um, you need to learn you know, your own Forex trading system, which isn't that difficult. And you know, then you can trade it with confidence and discipline. If you're trading long term, then you can make money in about 30 minutes a day. And you know, you, you know, you can have a really good income in your spare time. You don't need to believe all these myths that you're sold, sold online. You can actually learn about trend following for free. Um, all the information you need is on the net. I mean, we obviously have a course here which we teach. Um, which is kind of a fast track way of learning trend following. And, you know, we, we've been basically using the system now for 25 years. You know, I often get people write to me and say, oh, well, it, it's old, it's not algorithmic, you know, it's not been updated. It doesn't need to be updated because the principles of good trading never go out of date. You know, markets fundamentally do not change. They produce big trends and they'll always do so. The real key to Forex trading to success is to understand what you're doing and to basically understand how the Forex markets work. Um, be prepared to take quite a few losses and run your profits. Now, most traders just want to win all the time on their trades. That isn't possible. But for the trader who wants to just make money, he's not going to care if he loses 50% of his trades or 60%. It doesn't matter. As long as he's got money in the bank at the end of the day, that is what his aim is and should be the aim of any trader. Now, Forex trading is a, is a serious business. You need to know what you're doing. You need an education, as I've just said. Um, it doesn't take long to educate yourself. So for the actual effort you put in, the rewards are staggering. So always remember, 95% of traders lose. And those traders will all believe in the scalping and day trading myth that it makes money, 90% accuracy, and the algo trading is great and hedge funds make money. Don't believe it. It's not true. The facts show it's not true. Um, I've given you um, some great traders who really did make money and, and their view of the market. If you bear that in mind, think about it. Um, you'll come to the same conclusion I did 20-odd you know, years ago. Long-term trend following is the way to make money in the market, and you should be doing it for yourself and um, not relying on anyone else. Get your education, and you'll do just fine at trend following. Take care. Thank you.